How's it going, everyone? I'm Nostalgic Dave, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. Yeah, you heard me right. Wind Waker. I don't know what a Wind Waker is, but we're gonna go with it anyway. Alright, so we're supposed to go in here. And this thing's. Wait. I still don't get how this thing just poof opens. Well, I just fell into an obli- uh, okay. Are you him? Are you the one who's speaking through my stone without my permission? Answer me! That stone is an enhanced version of the Gossip Stones long spoken of in the Legends of Hyrule and blah 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 that. You made it? The royal family's gossip that uh, We're only this far into the video and I can't. I can't. I'm sorry, but I have no idea what you're talking about. Have neither of you heard the tales? Tales of the kingdom spoken of in legend of the great hero. The place where the power of the gods lies hidden. Hyrule? This place. Where the two of you now stand is that kingdom. This is Hyrule. Yep. And I am its king. The Daphnis Nohansen Hyrule. That's a medieval name if I've never heard one. <laughs> Link, do you not recognize my voice? My, my knees give me a moment, I'm drinking something. You want some? Indeed, I am the one who guided you here. I am the King of Red Lions. Okay. I don't know if you heard that or not, but something went just through my throat going... <laughs> <laughs> there it goes again, going... <laughs> there was no need for me to reveal my true identity to you so long as that blade, the Master Sword, could defeat Ganon. But now, both of you must listen to me. Tetra don't seem too happy with you. Are you sure you want to ask that of her? Once, long ago, this land of Hyrule turned into a world of shadows by Geth, who sought to obtain the power of gods for his own evil ends. Yeah, he didn't succeed. I kicked his behind. I mean, the other Link did. <laughs> That's not Link. <laughs> My power alone could not stop the fiend, and our only choice was to leave the fate of the kingdom in the hands of the gods. Good idea! When the gods heard our pleas, they chose to seal away not only Ganon, but Hyrule itself. So, with a torrential downpour of rains from the heavens, our fair kingdom was soon buried beneath the waves, forgotten at the bottom of the ocean. Well, that's horrible. Yet all was not lost. For the gods knew that to seal the people away with the kingdom would be, would be to grant Ganon's wish for the destruction of the land. Yeah, that's not what we want. Not at all. So before the sealing of the kingdom, the gods chose those who would build a new country and commanded them to take refuge on the mountaintops. Makes sense. Those people were your ancestors. Hundreds of years have passed since then. So long as Ganondorf was not revived, Hyrule would remain below, never waking from its slumber. Tetra, come to me. What? 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 What are we doing? We're playing poker now? I'm not ready, I'm too young. <laughs> This necklace you wear is part of a sacred treasure called the Triforce of Wisdom, which has been passed down for many ages within the royal family of Hyrule. Your mother passed this down to you and instructed you to treasure it and to guard it with your life. Am I not correct? Uh ow! The Triforce of Wisdom is none other than the sacred power of the gods that we have kept from Ganon's clutches for so many long years. Oh, I bet they were long. 
the gods placed upon your ancestors the task of protecting it from evil's grasp. You too must abide by the laws of the past, so the time has come for me to teach you the fate into which you were born, the very reason that you live. Um, what? Since when is this the link to the past? I think it's Birdie. Oh no, you're back. <laughs> It's a very pretty butterfly. Look, Bob, that's not a butterfly. What you talking about? It's very shiny, very flappy. It must be a butterfly. Ooh. No, you're right. That ain't a butterfly. That's a pretty pony. Can I pet its head? <laughs> no, Bob. You cannot pet its head. You cannot pet her head. Hi, Zelda. My fate. You are the true heir of the royal family of Hyrule, the last link in the bloodline. We can change that! Shut up, Bob. You are Princess Zelda. I actually like this variant of Zelda's lullaby. Zelda? I'm... a princess? Surprise! You are confused, aren't you? I suppose such is to be expected. Link, I am terribly sorry that you have been caught up in this event. But now that it is known that... Oh, but now that... Oh, I knew what I was doing. Th this is why I don't let you voice act, Bob. What you talking about? The pretty pony was speaking. I just know it in my gut. <laughs> uh, 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 okay, Bob. Yeah, okay. But now that it is known that Tetra is indeed Princess Zelda, Ganon will be searching frantically for this child in an attempt to get the power of the gods that she possesses. He will not rest until he has found her. Uh-oh. If he succeeds, my ancient kingdom under the sea will be turned into a land of shadow and despair. And so will the world you know above the waves. That's not good. Link. I need you to lend me your strength in this dark hour. I have a suspicion about what has caused the Master Sword to lose its power. I need for you to come with me back to the lands above the water and return the power to repel evil to the Master Sword. Zelda? It is far too dangerous for you to join us on this task. Fortunately, this sacred chamber is not yet known to Ganon. It is my wish that you wait here in hiding until we return. But I don't want to leave. I want to have some quality time with... Uh, what was your name again? You forget this stuff way too easy, but shut up! Link. Link, we must go. Wait, 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 wait about that. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. Link. Yeah? Let me read it. I want to read it. I think I know what it says. Uh-oh. Alright, Bob. Fine, you can read it. Will you come into my bed with me? I want to have a little bit of a no. Shut up, Bob. I was just gonna say I wanted to have a drink with you. We're just gonna watch a movie or something. That's not what you were gonna say. Yes, you were. I was gonna say we all wanted the popcorn and kiss you in the garden cheeks. But you said you. I don't know how to say this. See? I told you this is exactly what she's gonna say. Everything that's happened to you and your poor sister, it's all been my fault. You were saying? She was thinking it. <laughs> Shut up, Bob. I'm so sorry. He's just like, eh, it's fine. 
think. Be careful. Well, now she's gonna be alone. It's all your dang fault, I'm gonna... Bob, I'm gonna put you in the corner. No, not the drain corner. Me no like the corner. Last time I got in the corner, Jeremy licked my butthole and I didn't like it for crap. <laughs> what? <laughs> so, after we get to the surface, I've actually got a very specific plan of things that we're gonna do. We're gonna finish up with the charts that I feel like need to be finished, which are basically just the um, heart piece charts. From there, we're gonna head over to Windfall and take care of some stuff there. So let's get started. Hey, are you a banana? A banana? Yes, it's a banana, she. It goes sideways like one. Can I peel its head off and eat its center? It's not how you eat a banana. Boom, honky. I'm not even going to question this. <laughs> Link, listen well. The fact that the Master Sword lost the power to repel evil suggests to me that something has happened. This is no crap. Who infused the blade with the god's power? Sages should be here in high rule, in the Wind Temple to the north and Earth Temple to the south, praying to the gods. Must heed, must head for these two temples to see what has happened to the sages and attempt to find a way to recover the power to repel evil. Unfortunately, Ganon seems to have erected some sort of magical barrier down here in high rule, blocking our path to the temples. But. Each temple should have another entrance high upon Hyrule's mountaintops, which are now islands above the sea. Okay. As always, I shall mark these places on your sea chart. Now then, if we stay here much longer, we shall draw our attention, enemy's attention to Princess Zelda's whereabouts. We must return to the surface immediately. Okay. I mean, I was going to return to the surface anyway, but can I get on your... Can I open you up so I can eat you? I probably should rephrase that, but I'm gonna refrain of doing so. I did that entire wrong. All right, so I did look up a little bit because one of the ma one of the treasure charts that I need to get. Um, I actually have a list of uh, treasure charts on my second screen. That's why I keep looking up. What? Link, do you know the legend of the hero of farts? <laughs> That's not what that says, Bob. I'm pretty sure it is. That says the hero of time. No, it don't. <laughs> Go drink your Gatorade, Bob. It ain't Gatorade, it's beer. Is that why you call yourself Beer Belly Bob? <laughs> Oh, right. you want go go drink your whatever you got. I don't care. Link, do you know the legend? <sighs> do you know the legend of the hero of time? Once long ago, he defeated Ganon and brought peace to the kingdom of Hyrule. He said the Triforce was given to the hero of time, and he kept it safe, much as Zelda kept hers. That sacred peace is known as the Triforce of Courage. When the hero of time was called to embark on another journey and left the land of Hyrule, he was separated from the elements that made him a hero. It is said that at that time, the Triforce of Courage was split into eight shards and hidden throughout the land. Even I do not know where they rest, but this much I do know. They lie hidden somewhere in the Great Sea. I hope so, otherwise I can't find them. Triforce of Courage is the only key that will open, once again open the doorway to Hyrule. You must search for it. Wait, so I can't go- oh. Oh, I can't go back. Well, Zelda, you have fun being stuck down there. That is your name, right? I thought it was Peach, but I kept getting it. Bop! Stop it! Oh. Alright, so first off, what we're actually gonna do is we're going to warp to Dragon Roost Island. 
Don't worry, we're not going over to Dragon Woods. We're actually going to a submarine that we've been to before. This submarine is going to allow me to get one more um, What are they called again? I actually don't remember what they're called. Fooey. So firstly... Okay, I think I need to be here. Yeah. I hope this is the right one. Otherwise, I'm going to be kind of sad. Because there's so many submarines. I need one more moblin. That's what I'm looking for. I'm looking for a last moblin. However, I don't particularly know which submarine has the right moblin. Like the moblin I'm looking for. Like... I know it's either going to be the one that I'm heading towards now. I, I think it is, actually. If not, it's to the west of it. I think. We might be on a hunt for a while. Because I don't remember this stuff. <laughs> See, you don't remember what the banana even looked like on the inside. That's why I was wondering if I can open it up and eat it. Maybe it's brown, I don't mind. I like brown bananas. Well, no wonder you act the way you do. Shut up. Actually, I think this might be the wrong one. I want to make sure, though. <sighs> okay. Well, I'm going to skip ahead when we get there. I want to watch, have you guys watch. I'll skip ahead to when we get to the right submarine. I'll be inside the submarine when, I get, when you guys see me again. So, see you guys in just a hot minute. Okay, I might have been wrong about which submarine it was, but not by much. I wasn't too far off. Rah! <laughs> you know what? Thanks. That's literally all we came for. Ow. Alright, you want to fight? Well, that was helpful. Here, there's an ow. Yeah, no. That's not allowed. <laughs> is that it? Did we do this one yet? I think we did. Yeah, we did. I can see the open chest. Yeah, that's what I figured. Alright, let's go! Gee, that was so hard. You did nothing, Bob. What you talking about? I ate something. That's basically nothing, Bob. All right, well, when can I pet the pretty pony? Um, I'm not gonna see her for a while, Bob. Well, I wanna pet some pretty pony. Maybe it can't be that one, but I'd love to pet a pretty pony. What don't you improve? What? Maybe we could do it here. Yeah, we'll, we'll see. How many times have we come back to this island at this point? Oh, my back is just going blah, 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 blah. Oh, hi. Actually, I'll talk to you in a sec. Firstly, well, actually, first. I 
I'm doing this, by the way, in a com Hello. I did not mean to run into you. Ow. Yeah, that works. That works just fine for me. As long as it can get the job done. Oh, great. Now I'm starting to sound like Bob. Hey, great. Sound like me is the ball dig. Excuse me? Hi. You there. Halt. Oh, you're just some wretched street veteran. Thought you were the post. No wonder. Are you even the same guy I saw out there? You're a prick. I'd have shooed you out if you ever thought you could say boo. Say, you look rather familiar. For a street urchin. Have we perhaps met before someplace? Yes. Here. You're gonna piss me off if I stay here much longer. This is one of those skull necklaces that my daughter Maggie brought back from the Forsaken Fortress. We sell quite well as at antique shops. In fact, it was thanks to these beauties that I became so filthy rich overnight. Eh? From the looks of it, I'd say you have about 20 of these, don't you? Okay, Bob, your second, your, your, your voice is the second weirdest I've ever heard. This guy is the weirdest. Well, thanks, I wait a minute. Mine ain't weird. Mine's completely norm. Have you heard yourself? Yeah. I'm the kind of norm person you'll find in a bar every day. That's why they call me Beer Belly Bob. You've never drunk a beer in your life. Are you sure about that? Do you want to ask Jasmine? Never mind. Because that's not her name. What you talking about? She's the pretty pony in the sheet. <laughs> First of all, that's Zelda. And second of all, what? Me. I'll be bathing in money yet again. The money bath, the only bath that gets you filthy, filthy rich. All right, boy, I'll give you this as a tip. Now, I'm not thanking you or anything. I'm just feeling good today. Cool. I will never cross paths with you again because I don't like you. How your daughter, on the other hand, I might want to go talk to her. I was once quite poor myself, you know. Back then, I used to dream of owning a boat. But I could use to go off in search of treasure. Now look at my filthy riches. Chase your dreams, little urchin. I don't want to be rich, though. I'm not little. I'm not an urchin. I'm a good boy. Mama told me. <laughs> you said you said my voice was weird. Now, did you just hear his deal? Shut up, Bob. Shortcuts. All right. So first of all, let's go ahead and open that up, that chart up. Let's see chart number two, I believe. Okay. Well, I know where that is. Is it on? Don't say it, Bob. Pickle Douche Isle! Okay, that's not what you were, I thought you were going to say. But no, it's not on Pickle Juice... Pickle Juice Isle? Where the hell is Pickle... What? Okay, so I need to be here? No. 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 Here. Here. Yeah, I need to be there. So southwest, not northwest. Southwest. Oh gosh, Tingle Island. I don't like Tingle Island. Am I going the right way? Yeah. Alright, well I'll see you guys over on Rockspire Island in just a moment. Alright y'all, we're gonna pull out a monkey. I, I don't know how we're gonna do it, but we're gonna do it anyway. That's not close enough, Bob. Well, food. Let's 
seriously? Oh, I hate these sharks. There we go. All right. Here's a piece of heart now. I need to double check my list as it's doing this animation to see which is the next one I'm gonna need to get that I can actually get right now. Cool. All right, have we gotten the one from... Ow. I need to check to see which charts we have. Three. Okay, so we got four. All right, we got that one. We got 11, right? Yep. Did we get 15? I believe we did. Yeah, we did. Uh. Do we get number 23? Yes. Do we get number 82? Bob, there are not 82 charts in this game. Are you sure? I think that says 82. That says 23, Bob. We just talked about this. No, I don't. <sighs> All right, anyway, um, 30, we get 30. Yep, and 31, uh-huh, 33, yep, and 38. Boom, okay, so we got all the pieces, heart. <laughs> Um, so we got all the heart pieces we can for right now. We literally have two left and they are The maps that we get for those are going to be in The two temples that we have to go to Otherwise, we're pretty much done with the treasure charts the generic treasure charts I'm not gonna go around and get all the rupees and the additional charts when I'm using a guide anyway so yeah we're almost done so that's all we're going to do with charts for right now let's go ahead and head back to um much thorn we're going to head over to thorn fairy island next which i need to double check where that is found it <laughs> which is that closest to bomb island it's two west of Tower of the Gods. Got it. Did I say two west? Did I seriously say two west? Yes, you did. Shut up, Bob. I know. At least you heard something, right? I know, right? Go ahead and ask a man to that. Her name is Zelda. I'm not talking about the little pretty pony. I'm talking about a different pretty pony. What? The, what? I don't know. I'm just pouring out words. I'm just going to my butt and come out of my mouth. I don't even know what I'm saying sometimes. That would make a lot of sense. Yeah, I'm gonna go drink a beer. And he's gone. Okay. Guarantee he'll be back within a short period of time, though, knowing him. Okay, I need to be going east. Am I facing east right now, actually? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, this is one of the fairies that I haven't done yet. In fact, right now we're going to be getting two different, three different... 
We're gonna be getting a lot of fairies right now taken care of. I can't speak properly at the moment. I think that's it over there, actually. All right, well, again, won't waste your guys' time watching me do this. I'll meet you over at the island in just a moment. Okay, y'all, we are approaching this, and out to the boat, Link. You don't need to be in the boat right now. <laughs> Why? Glad Bob's not here, otherwise. Hey, what is that? It looks like a dancing mailbox. That is a dancing mailbox, Bob. Well, that ruined it. Never mind. Bye. Yeah, okay, see ya. Wow, okay. Two letters. Cash on delivery. Postage. This is Tingle, isn't it? Is that a Tingle or Beetle? No, because Beetle only let, did like 10, I think. This is Tingle, isn't it? <sighs> yep. Another reason why I hate Tingle, right here. So basically, the, yeah, the Triforce charts are hidden. Where are these chart tells me? Here's a letter. What's this one? How have you been, big brother? I'm here on the pirate ship writing this letter. Is it not me? It's not Jeremy. No, Bob, that's his sister. Yeah, Jeremy. I've never met a girl named Jeremy before. Correct me if I'm wrong. I'm pretty sure that's not a girl's name, but there might be a girl out there named Jeremy somewhere. Here, I'm Brave Nathan. Go to your corner, Bob. First, I was really scared, but they're actually really nice for pirates. I mean, Mr. Gonzo is a really big guy, but ever since ever since Miss Tetra left, he's been crying like a baby. It's kind of funny. It's sort of sad too. Not just a little strange, but nice too. My dad's for Senza. His beard makes him look pretty mean, but he tells really cool stories when he gets in the right mood. Zuko's kind of weird, and Mako is pretty quiet. Mako immediately gets mad whenever I try to take his glasses, so I do that a lot. Hee <laughs> hee. As usual, Nico is always fooling around. He won't take anything serious. Actually, he seems sad not to have you around anymore. Were you guys good friends? I helped them all out with their chores, and they actually paid me a little for it, so I'm sending the money to you. Please use it, big brother. I, I probably will, quite frankly. I'll loan you my telescope for a little longer, but you have to return it to me eventually, okay? I'm doing fine here, so don't you worry. I'll take care of myself, so you be sure to take good care of yourself. Good luck, Errol. Well, that was sweet. Thanks, little sis. Now, I am I have the wrong item out. I mean, I could try to hit it with that thing. It probably won't. Fuck. Don't. No. No. Are those balloons? Can I have one? I mean, you can have one if you want, but I can guarantee those are not balloons. What the fuck? Wait, is that timed? Ugh, oh, jeez. I don't think I realized it was timed until now. Yeah, okay. I know what's in here. I'm getting rid of the water. Let's drink the water, man. No, drink the water. This is what you're supposed to do with the water, Link. Drink it. Can I have some? I don't need your beer lips all over my water, Bob. How'd you know what I drank? You have a bunch of them over in the corner over there. No, they're not. It's Gatorade. Since when is Gatorade owned by Budweiser? Uh, two weeks ago. No. Young week of the winds. Allow me to aid you in your class. Oh, 
Sure. Next up, Western Fairy Island. The fairies in the fountain shall ease you of your weariness. You grow fatigued from your battles. Come here to refresh. Okay. Got one. Got one more bottle we can get too, actually. Last one last one we're gonna get is like super easy to get though. I mean like it's laughable how easy this particular one is to get. So uh we're gonna get that next time though. Just checking. Where is Western Fairly Island again? Right there. So, northwest of Great Fish Isle, which is where we're going to teleport. Kill. There we go. I guess technically I could have done the other song I was going to do. Oh, is it the song of friendly? The, the, wait, the song of what? Franny! Are you even saying word? Yeah! Can you say it any more clear, please? Franny! It sounds like you're saying friendly and fanny at the same time, Bob. I am! That's not a word. Yes, sir! Bob, no. <laughs> no, no, Bob. Yeah! Am I really going to have this argument with an alternate self? Really? <laughs> okay. This should be northwest. I think. Yeah, because it was southwest of Tingle and... Ugh. Tingle. Ugh. I'm right, aren't I? Yep. Bob went quiet. Probably a good thing, too. Okay, good. Bob fell asleep. Okay, there's the island right there. Meet you guys over there in a hot sack. Alright, good thing he's still asleep. Otherwise, this would not go well for me. Go ahead and change over to the hammer. <sighs> Hello. Hey, is that a pretty point? Oh. That's a pretty pony. I like that pretty pony. Can I pet the pretty pony? A good pony. Good pony. Oh, jeez. Allow me to aid you in your quest. Ooh, the pretty pony can talk. Uh. Pretty pony. Go back to sleep, Bob. We're almost done anyway. Aw, oh, dang. Got literally one more destination, and then we'll end the video there. The fairies in the sea, yeah, it's the same thing. I get it. Bye. We're going to go by one more location, and then I'll end the video at um, Windfall Island, actually. I believe that's all the on ocean stuff that I'd want to do right now anyway. This one I'm not going to cut to because you teleport and you're there. Yep. <laughs> I 
All right. All right. Well, this is an interesting place. That's a lot of cheers for one fairy. <laughs> Tell me, little boy, can you control the wind? I can. <laughs> so young to have such power. How did you know to find me here? Memory. <laughs> Actually, this is entirely true. I already knew about this. That's why I've avoided teleporting here. I am the queen of the fairy world. What's the matter, my child? Does that not surprise you? No one? A little bit. You're a child. I like you. So I shall give you new power to the bow that you wield. I'm gonna need this. What? What is going on? Well, I know what's going on, but why? Why are we doing it this way? Hi. Hi. That felt weird. Hey, now I can do fire arrows and ice arrows. The only arrows we're missing now are the light arrows. We ain't getting those anytime soon. I said I was gonna freeze that. I know how they work. Raising this fountain will ease you from weariness. Use them as you need to. Sounds good. Child? Must tell you. You are just my type. Tee Oh! How dare you! I was the one who's your type. No, you're not, Bob. Go to sleep. Aw. He's blushing. <laughs> okay, bye. Alright, so let's teleport over to Windfall Island got quite a bit we can do over there actually a few things at least we're not gonna do it this episode but we do have quite a bit could do one more thing just to get it out of the way real quick. Um, where are we on time? Uh, nah. You know what? Mm. Nah, screw it. There we go. For some reason my brain couldn't process that. Alright, so this is going to jump skip to a point, because, huh? It was not night time. There. It was like dusk or something. Guess that counts as night or something. Ow. Better. Alright. Let's take care of this really quickly, and this will be the last thing for this video. Hi. You don't take off. Go away. Oh, fine. Jeez. All right. It's gonna take her a run all the way around, but I'll see you guys once she gets all the way over here again. See you guys in a hot sec.
Well, I almost got caught. Because this idiot started yawning. Hey. You startled me. What, what, what do you want? My, my, my heart is racing. You scared me. Wait, are you the kind of creep who goes around the night scaring people? That's just plain mean. Just what do you think you are? Just who do you think you are anyway? Now I have justice. Oh, uh, what? I mean, this is technically true. Uh, I'm not a thief, I swear. I haven't stolen anything. Well, yet. Please let me go. It's just an impulse, that's all. Just a bad idea. <sighs> Why won't you say anything? Does this mean you're mad at me? Could you at least listen to the circumstances in my life that led up to this moment? Please, you owe me that much. No, I don't, but sure. I was once the richest. Okay, you know what? Little debutante in this town. Did you know that? Yes. One day a monstrous bird came and took me away from our ter to a terrible place called the Forsaken Fortune. We all agree that's a terrible place. I'm betting Bob, if he wasn't dead asleep by now, would too. My father spent every last rupee in his coffers in the attempt to get me rescued. That's right. Every last bit of our family fortune gone. That was when my life of poverty began. Now, every day from morning until night, I'm busy working for the open air shop. So, as you can see, at least I'm trying to settle into my poor lifestyle. You're not just tugging your heartstrings. Part of it, yes. Most of it, no. Sorry. But I'll say that. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Bob, go to bed. I thought it was pretty funny. <laughs> Whatever. To make matters worse, for some reason I still can't figure out that slob Maggie, who was the poorest girl in town, suddenly got filthy rich. Maggie, of all people. Makes me so mad that I want to do something terrible. <sighs> you understand my plight? Yeah. Then you'll let me go? No. But why not? Because I'm honest. It's true. I know I'm quibbling over nothing. But being so poor weakens a person's very soul. You're crazy, lady. But it's time I quit making silly excuses for myself. Thank you so much. Thanks to you. I didn't have to sink down to the level of common thief. You almost did. You were like this close. I will never do anything like that again. Ah, oh, what an amazing feeling. I've let all my worries out of my heart. Well, I actually feel refreshed. Let me at least thank you. Please take this. Last bottle of the game. This is the first time I've ever actually collected all four empty bottles. And technically, this is the first playthrough of this where I'd end up getting all heart pieces and containers. Probably the only one, too. Don't look at me like that. I didn't steal it. It washed up on the shore. So I picked it up. No, you took it. You took it from my wallet. Go to bed, Bob. Don't tease me like that. It's a tiny bottle made of crystal clear glass. It's so beautiful. I wish my soul could be that beautiful. Oh my gosh. Whatever. What am I saying? When you live in poverty, you can say the cheesiest things without blinking an eye. <laughs> so, um... I guess I should go soon. My father will start to worry. Goodbye, little ally of justice. And good luck to you. Thanks. Bye. Thanks for tonight. Past couple episodes have been pretty extensive. This episode, last episode. I think the episode before too as well. So I had to cut some things out. So off screen I am going to go get fill that last bottle with a fairy. But we'll start the next episode here on Windfall. In the meantime, I am going to leave this video here. So, thank you guys so much for watching this episode. If you liked it, push that like button and so far you can't see it anymore. If you're curious where the joke of Bob came from or the character now, uh, alternate self the mine came from, I'll have a link in the description below um, to the video that did it because I don't have room to what I'm going to do here. Um, another game, another Zelda game that I've done prior to this one will be across my head here. This game will be in the top corner, but if you have a suggestion for one that I haven't done that you'd like to see, let me know in the comments below. In the meantime, 
I'm going to head out, but I'll see you guys later. Bye.